say a few things about finding your tribe. Um, for those of you that have followed uh, our Full Tiny House channel, and which is our family channel, channel, um, you know that we have friends that we call our tribe. Um, you know, we, we call people that not to disrespect our own family, but to do it um, just as a <clears throat> becomes our, our friends in our community out here as nomads. Um, you know, we travel around and meet up with our friends and travel with our friends, which we call our tribe. And it's just something that that we do and um, some, you know, other uh, people do that as well in the RV community or people that are in their van, trailers, pull trailers and stuff like that. So the people that you feel comfortable with, people, people that you have things in common with, and um, we definitely have um, our values, uh, you know, being a family and having children and we are going to protect um, our family unit and watch over our children uh, and do the best we can with that situation. And so the people we have are uh, surrounding us now are friends, tribe, whatever you want to call it, uh, our children as well. And we trust, you know, uh, the group that we're with. And uh, when we're around um, others that are doing, you know, partying too much and you know getting wild and crazy it's that's that's not our thing i'm 51 now i'm past all that stuff but that's kind of the reason i haven't been going around the uh at the party r area that much um, as far as what's going on there um i love playing music learning songs people giving me suggestions for songs i'm actually working on some songs that, that people have suggested through my youtube channel and uh, I miss being in, I miss being in, in a band, but uh, it's very difficult to be in a band and, uh, you know, do that stuff when you have a family and your, you know, your, your hands don't uh, feel like playing every other day and you, you just never know, like I never know when my hands are going to feel good or bad. I have the carpal tunnel problems. I've had the surgery in one of my hands. My right hand, I, I haven't had it in my left one. I don't know if I ever will. But I have to pace myself as far as playing. You know, at the van build that we attended, we did the uh, music jam that one night, and I had a blast. I loved it, but I haven't played for extended periods of time like I did that night, and that took a toll on me. It hurt my hands and my arm was hurting uh, for days, you know, the nerves in there get, uh, pinched and, um, and it's just a lot of pain. So, um, I try not to play, you know, hours on end, but that night was just fun and we were having a blast and, and I enjoyed myself very much that night. And so, but then the day after, and even several days after I paid for it. And so it kind of makes me realize you know i can't do this that often so uh i'm going to continue to you know when i work up songs and, and that i and that i enjoy playing uh i would feather acoustic players and and play and and enjoy that uh time but you know to me the timing's got to be right and the uh atmosphere has to be right as far as creating drama i'm not a you know that type of person um, I just say it how it is, and if you want to take it as drama, that's on you. Um, I said some things in another video about how it seemed to be quieter and wondered if the Rangers had come out and talked to somebody, and, uh, and I got a, uh, had a discussion with someone that had information about that and confirmed that the Rangers didn't show up, and, and I cleared that up. So, But, you know, there's nothing wrong with saying, hey, I wonder if... I wonder if that's all I was doing with that situation. So take it how you take it how you want to take it. You know that's the way it went. Um, I you know like to just talk about things and things that are going on in my daily life, my daily routine. See how I see it. If you like it, awesome. If you don't, you don't have to watch my videos. Uh, you know where everyone's adults and free to to make their decisions. 
people that leave, leave nasty comments. I've left some of those on uh, just to show that this person, you know, is an idiot and uh, to let people see what, a, what an idiot it, that person is. And they're probably more than likely just a troll with a made up name and they just go and comment ugly stuff to people on their videos. That's what a troll is in the YouTube world. Doing more music videos. Uh, let me know what you like, what you want to hear. If it's something I think fit, that I can do and play it well and I'll play it. If I don't end, ever end up, you know, playing that song or whatever that you suggest, don't, you know, get your feelings hurt. It's just, maybe it's not a good song for me or uh, my style or whatever. And I don't know. Um, but yeah, I really love people commenting and the feedback from everyone and i really enjoy all of that and so uh keep it up and so uh keep it up and i will keep putting out the videos so that is all for now and i hope everybody has a wonderful weekend thank you <laughs>